It has been a little over seven weeks since a Stebbins High School student collapsed during track practice. She's still recovering at the University of Cincinnati Medical Center after receiving a heart transplant. Two News reporter Riley Phillips sat down with this student's mother for the first time since the transplant and has continuing coverage of this remarkable journey. Ebony Sherwood continues to make progress here at the University of Cincinnati Medical Center. Her mom tells me she's up and walking, even cracking some jokes. She remembers being at track and then she woke up here. It's been a whirlwind for Stebbins High School senior Ebony Sherwood. She said she's never felt so weak, so that's like a big, big struggle for her. Ebony suffered a heart attack during track practice on March 7th. She was then flown to UC Medical Center where she's been ever since. Her mom Beverly has not even been home yet, staying by her daughter's side during some of the toughest moments of their lives. It's been hard just we're a little over an hour from home, so trying to make sure we have a dog at home, that somebody's taking care of the dog and getting our house ready and accessible for her when she does come home, um, trying to work here, that's like a little difficult, but this three sport athlete is a fighter after receiving a heart transplant a little over a month ago. Ebony is finally starting to act like herself again. It's been such a relief. Um, you know, like you never know like what kind of brain damage or like personality changes and things like that. And I would say like especially this last week, she's just really been herself. So she cracks jokes and she talks about things at school and her track team came down and visited and she got to talk to some of the new throwers and was like giving them advice on what to do. This road to recovery has not been easy though. Her mom says there have been some setbacks and hard days. She's grateful for the support from the doctors and staff at UC Medical Center and she knows this process would have been even more difficult without the love from family and friends and people she's never even met. One of the people from the school is mowing our grass for the summer to take care of that. We have friends taking care of our dog. We have like businesses in the area that are doing fundraising to support us. And it's all just been like a weight, weight off your shoulders to know that everybody is there. And Ebony is hoping to leave the hospital soon. She'll have to spend a few weeks in a rehab facility before finally being able to go home. In Cincinnati, Riley Phillips, 2 News.